are not doing prostitution. We are not doing a shower here. So you guys to you guys should stop painting as black, okay? We are suffering. All you have to do is just play for us so that we can finish our contract and come home safely. Okay, we beg you. We are not doing any prostitution. Hey guys, it's your girl about Pam Maggie, and I'm here once again with another VT. So guys, thank you so much for subscribing. Now we hit 200 subscribers and I'm so much grateful for you guys. I don't know what to do for you guys to know that I do appreciate what you are doing. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please, please subscribe to my channel, okay? Let's keep Timobapa Magi to the world. And also, I'll start uh, doing, I'll do some video. I'll do video about uh, the comment and also I'll mention your name and also give thanks to you all. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and comment, guys. It's very important. Comment so that if I do that video, I can mention your name in my video because I do appreciate everything. Your comment, your like, your subscribe, your support, your motivation words, your encouragement. I mean, everything. So, guys, in this video... Uh, there is something going on that I just want to address it for you guys to know what is go uh, what is going on or what you guys are hearing is fake. Okay, a friend of mine have been saying she want to travel to Arab country to do this shagala work, this kadama work, but her mom and dad have been saying we are doing prostitution there, we are doing a shower, we are sleeping with men and. I have do a lot of video to convince the parents that we are not doing a shower. Even sometimes when I'm washing, ironing, I call video calls and still the parents don't understand. And I don't know why they have been saying we are doing a shower here. No one will come here and suffer. No one will go through what we are going and be saying he, she's doing a shower. Guys, this is getting out of hands. And if me, I'll do a shower. Like I was saying, my country. If I want to do a shower here, I'll stay in my country to do a shower. Because in your country, you can go out. You can eat what you want. You can get local food. Because me, I'm a fan of food. I like food. So I can't leave all this uh, natural vegetables, contomile, you know. And come and stay here eating uh, eat some flour and uh, eating some stuff of some kind of food that I don't like. Okay? So please, no one is doing a shower here. Nobody is doing a shower here. We are doing house job. And what we are going through is not, it's not easy. You wake up on time. We work with time, we wake up with time, we sleep with time, everything with time. Okay? We do everything with time. We don't have off days, we don't rest, we don't we don't we don't have control of even our body. What to wear, what to eat, what to do. I just, I just can't imagine how people been saying uh, working in Arab country is a prostitution and stuff. Nobody is doing prostitution, and those who even run from the contract how, home, they go find another job. They go do another job. So if somebody tells you that we are doing prostitution in Arab country, it's a lie. We are doing house job. The shagala. Shagala. Shagala is what we are doing, and we are not ashamed of that. Because doing prostitution, for me to do prostitution, eh, like I will choose the shagala work. Because at the end of the month, I, I will get my salary. I can send some to my family, to my, my child. 
and also save some for my future. So if anybody tells you that we are doing a shower, if anybody says that those in Arab countries have been doing a shower or we are doing prostitution, tell the person it's a lie. It's a lie. If you have somebody who has traveled to Arab country who is doing this house job, what you have to do is just pray for the person. Pray for the person. Ask for uh, good health. Ask for patience. And also ask God to protect the person to finish her contract and come back home safely for you to have your, your, your family back. And don't be saying staying in Arab country is Shagala, stay in Arab country. Nobody will leave this, this freedom country. Nobody will leave Africa. Just I'm from Ghana. In Ghana, we have freedom. If you have your money, you have your job, nobody will control you. Nobody will tell you what to eat. Nobody will tell you time to sleep. Nobody will tell you time to wake up. Nobody will tell you even dress, what to wear. Even you can't go out. Since I came into this house, I've been in this house for two years, I think three, two, two years, three months or so. I have never go out on my own. Even if I'm, I want to go out, I have to ask permission. And going out, I'm not going out in peace. Where are you? Where have you been? What time are you? I mean, only twice I have go out. In one, I went alone, and it wasn't easy. And the two, the, the, the twice also I went with my madam. She, even, she didn't even allow me to go out alone. So guys, don't, don't let somebody deceive you if you want to come to Arab sorry to Arab country and come and do house job don't let anybody deceive you that don't let anybody lie to you that is a shower don't let anybody put fear in you okay it's house job and those who come here and go back and be lying that we're doing a shower or stuff they are lazy they are lazy. Arab country, if you are lazy or you, 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 you want to be your own, you want to control yourself, nobody will come to Arab country who, who is lazy and feel okay in this country, okay? If you are lazy, you can't stay here. If you are lazy, you can't stay here. Because immediately you arrived in the house, you don't have control of yourself. You don't have control of yourself anymore. What to eat, time to sleep, time to wake up, what to wear is them. They will tell you what to do. And if you are lucky, if you are lucky and you get to a house that they will allow you to cook your own food, then you are good to go. Then you can choose what to eat and you're not going to get everything like you being in your country and also you don't have of this and if you're lucky you are, you you are two people they have two maid or three maid that's how you can feel happy talking smiling having fun with the other maid but if you're alone like me your friend is your phone and also when you, you have some so if you have some uh, you have free time, you can also call your family, friends, husband, and also chat. So what I want to tell you guys is like, nobody should believe that we are doing a shower in this country. Nobody is doing a shower. If It's only the lazy people who come here and they can't finish their contract, who come here and or some of them also forsake during the contract so they have to go back home okay because you can't do the job with sickness okay so don't ever believe that it's not easy um, I, I can't advise somebody who wants to come and do shagala work that it's easy it's not easy but if you you determine you have some aim that oh i want to i can do it just if you tell yourself you can do it it's it's just a matter of time a matter of time that 
it's just two years after two years you finish you take your money you go home do the business you want to do so please don't let anybody lie to you that we are doing a show i think i have to end this video here and see you on my next video so guys thank you for watching to this far and if you have been able if you have been able to watch to this fan please don't forget to give your girl a thumbs up subscribe comment and share okay share for other people to know that we are not doing a show in arab countries i love you guys and i can't wait to see you on my next video don't forget to say a players and say one for your girl okay because i love you Kiss, kiss. Mm -hmm.